this street rod just did it unique, especially in classics. 1931 Ford Model A. Good looking rod. Powered by a 305 GM small block. Power steering. That's paired up with a automatic transmission TH350. So turbo hydromatic 350. Paired up with that 305. All steel car. So steel fenders. Steel body. Take a look at the front end here. Nice polished and bright work on this vehicle really make it pop no doubt about that if you want to check out the still pictures so you can see the underside of it the interior engine bay check out the still pictures unique classic cars.com click on the link down below this video in the description if you're seeing it on youtube it's going to take you right there and of course you can call us 507-386-1726 cool feature on this car power windows Four power windows. The rear ones will also slide down under power. Kind of a cloth vinyl setup, as you can see. Tilt column, aftermarket gauges, and stereo. We're going to get around to the driver's side. Start it up, let you hear it run in just a bit. Check out that interior. French in taillights back here. Dual exhaust. Now remember, we do consider trades. Financing is available. Of course, we can assist with transportation, and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract. Consult with your sales associate when you call in or email. As you see, can see from the rear here, um, coilover, adjustable shocks, all four corners. Got an eight and three quarter Ford rear end in this one. Does have two tanks, kind of saddlebags, if you will, on each side. And behind the running boards, as you can see, the fill spout there. And check out the underside. You'll see what I'm talking about. Check out the suspension components and underside picks at uniqueclassiccars.com. Click the link down below this video in the description. It's going to take you right there. This build was completed in 2006 to 2007, according to the builders of it. Be a folder of receipts that will be included with the purchase of this vehicle and go with it. And miles, there's a little over 2,200 miles, I believe it was on the build also or since built take a look up and down the driver's side here you can see the paint shows well really free of much of any nicks scratches dings i did notice one little spot back here had a little bit of a rub on the fender but again overall nice looking rod tilt column over here gt steering wheel or Grant GT steering wheel, I should say. And how cool would this be? That back seat, grandkids or friends going with. You could roll down those rear windows, toss a little candy out, have some fun in a parade. Now, this also has poppers, FYI, the electronic door openers, electric. As you can hear that, it clicked. And just pull it open. Power window switches. And as you can see, once again, tilt column. All right, let me get that key. Let's fire this thing up. Check out the interior. Check out how it sounds. There is also battery shut off right underneath here. So you can shut that off. Take this with you. Come back, put this in. Turn it. We got battery power. All right, let's check out the miles. There it is, 22 we can quite see that 2280.9, so basically 2,281 miles since built. JVC stereo, video gauges, let's fire this thing up. See how easily that started? And FYI, as you can see, that was a cold start. Oil pressure gauge works. You've seen the speedo cycle through, fuel gauge working, and of course, there is a switch underneath the dash and I believe that's for switching the uh, tanks. I uh, check with the sales consultant, they could confirm that. There is also a little remote up here they have stashed 
for that radio so you can run that JVC off the remote and then speakers in the rear there. And as you can see, it's kind of a cloth vinyl combination in nice shape, hardly worn at all. These seat backs will fold down, easier to get in the back seat from the other side, especially with that folded down. Doors close and fit nicely. A little rumble coming out at 305. Let's go up and check out that engine bay. So it's running. Hey, did you know that this car qualifies for an extended warranty? It's just like the one you get at your new car dealership, except it covers your classic car instead. It covers all the major components like engine, transmission, drivetrain, and you can get coverage up to 10 years. Repairs aren't cheap. These extended warranties are a no-brainer. Contact us for a quote on this car today. A lot of chrome, HEI ignition, Edelbrock carb, like Edelbrock intake, again, power steering, electric fuller fan. They did have the hood for this too in metal. They do not have the brackets or it's set up to go on the car, but they did mention they had that if it's something the next owner would be interested in. But like I said, you'd have to do some of the fabrication yourself so it would fit. Make everything work on it. Overflow tank. Nicely built. Little 31 Model A street ride. Give us a call. 507 386 1726 uniqueclassiccars.com click the link down below this video in the description is going to take you right there remember we do consider trades financing is available of course we can assist with transportation and this vehicle may be eligible for an extended service contract consult with your sales associate when you call in or email